Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another photo piece tutorial. In this one, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make this rap album cover that looks real grungy and gritty and you get the idea from just looking at this picture here. Kind of like an old school looking cover, but I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now super quickly in photo piece. Without further ado, let's get started. All right, so once you're in photo piece, what we're going to do is start a new project. So click on new project. The size would probably be best as 1600 by 1600. But for the sake of the tutorial, I'm just going to do 800 by 800. So just do 1600 by 1600 and I'll do this. Hit create. Now find a background picture that you want to use. I just chose like a dark sky on Google. I found I just looked up nighttime. All right, to so put the background where I wanted it to be. So now we're going to add some grungy gritty effects. So online I looked up grunge effect PNG and I found this right here. So I'm just going to copy that and bring it in here. I'm going to turn the opacity down on it a little bit. You can't see it as much. Now what I'm going to do is look up paper rip PNG like this. I'm just going to copy that, bring it into photo P by hitting control V. Now I'm going to hit control alt and T to free transform it. And I'm going to grab one of these boxes and hold shift while I drag to make it smaller. And I'm going to hover outside of it to turn it like this, put it on the edge. Now double click on that layer and go to color overlay, change it to black. I'm going to hit control J to duplicate it and I'm going to hit control alt T to free transform it again. This time I'm going to bring it over on the left side like that. So it's coming together now. Now what I'm going to do is click on the background layer and go up to filter noise and add noise. It's going to make it look grainy, which will be good for what we're trying to do. Move that to the side a little more. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is look up the parental advisory PNG thing. This one right here, you see it on every wrap cover. Paste that in there. Control Alt T to resize it. Hold shift while you drag. And I'm just going to make this pretty small. And I'm going to put it at the bottom right like that. Now I'm going to type in some text. So I'm going to go with moon. I'm going to change the size up here to like 150. Hit Control Alt T and then drag outside of one of the corners to rotate it like that. Double click on the text and change the color overlay to white. Hit control J to duplicate it. This time move it down. Oops. Control Alt T and then move it down. I'm going to change this to light moonlight. I don't really know. I just thought it sounded cool. So I'm going with it. Move that right below the text like this. Now, last thing we're going to do is double click on our background layer. Actually, hold on. Click on the background layer and hit control J to duplicate it. Now double click on it and uncheck this R button. Hit OK. Hit control Alt T and drag it a little bit to the right. So it looks like that. I think it looks pretty cool. Now you can tweak a lot of this if you want. That's up to you. You do that whatever you want to do. Now I think it looks decent. Obviously could use some work, but it's a good start to get that gritty look. And uh, anyways, that's how you do it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.